Hi, I'm Zhao Wat Yu. I'm the chef of Holy Fook Restaurant in Hong Kong. Next, I'm going to make a steamed grouper with fermented chili, lardo, and preserved lemon. This dish is inspired by this, the greatest restaurant in Hong Kong, my favorite, called The Chairman. They do the same, but with a giant grouper head. So first, we're going to take this grouper, we're going to slice it in slices, then we're going to marinate it, okay? So I want it to be maybe about one centimeter slices. So you can use, um, you know, whatever fish actually. You can use a barramundi, which is kind of nice. You can use a giant grouper. This one is a tiger grouper. It will be just as good with maybe coral trout as well. So I think maybe a, a fish that is like a white fish, uh, not too fatty and mild in flavor. I wouldn't recommend using salmon, um, just because it's too fatty already. So next, we're gonna marinate this with egg white. So this, what the egg white does is to form like a protective uh, coating to steam when steaming, so it doesn't lose too many juices. A bit of cornstarch. Next, just a little bit of uh, bicarb. Sometimes giant grouper, when you get it at the market, it's too fresh. It's still in rigor mortis. So this just sort of break down the muscle fibers just a little bit, okay? Marinate this through. Now we're gonna set this aside. Okay, next, I'm gonna take some fermented chilies. Maybe two. I mean, these are long red chilies, so it's not that spicy. Um, but it's really funky with all the uh, lacto-fermented juices. That's been uh, going for a few years now. Um, so I'm just gonna roughly chop this. I don't want it to, to be like a puree. Now, if you can't find fermented chilies, you can also use a pickle chilies, okay? So at the supermarket, you can go to the chili section. They're gonna have chili oil, fermented chilies, pickle chilies, all types of different chilies. Okay, what I've got here is finely chopped preserved lemon. I freeze a whole lemon, so it really damages the structure of the lemon, and I cut it into uh, fours, but not all the way through, okay, into quarters. I pack it in salt, and then I sous vide it, and maybe about two weeks later, it's ready, okay? So this is, this is a house-made preserved lemon, but you can also use um, salted lemon. In um, the wet market, the, they have uh, ham leng mong, which is just as good, but you might have to adjust the seasoning a little bit because it's uh, already seasoned with salt. So what I've done here is to rinse it under the running water for a long time, then I finally chop it, okay? So I'm gonna add a bit of uh, preserved lemon, which is gonna add another layer of umami. And then we're gonna add the uh, smoked lardo, which is gonna slice really fine, okay? So I'm gonna slice this as thin as possible. And this is gonna add that like meaty richness and umaminess. So that's gonna be thin slices, I cut it in half. Right. And I mix this through. I'm gonna add a little bit of the fermented liquid, okay? A little bit of moisture, and uh, it's also gonna give it a little bit of a, like form the basis of the uh, dressing that we're gonna make. We're gonna lay the fish fillet, just sort of arrange it on the plate that's gonna go on. Then this mixture is gonna go on top. Okay, that's it. So, first thing that I'm gonna do is preheat the oven at 100 degrees steam before I get going, okay? So I've got an oven on now. So I need 100% humidity and hot air. I just preheat the oven. So now that I have the uh, oven preheated, I'm ready to cook. I'm ready to cook now. Okay. So this will go in for maybe about five to six minutes. So timer just went off. Let's check.
Okay, so let me taste first. So it's quite acidic from the fermenting juices. Uh, I just added a bit of water. Then I'm gonna add um, some soy sauce. Soy sauce. This here, I've got kombu extract, which is the extract from uh, kombu. Maybe like half a teaspoon. And to that, I'll add a bit of chili oil as well. That's uh, two tablespoons. We're ready to plate. Just lay the dressing over each piece of fish. Clean the plate a little. I'm going to finish the dish off with a bit of garnish, some chopped green shallots, this bowl of steamed rice. Happy days. <laughs>